beautiful day to you children how are you today wow it's nice to come your way again welcome back to our divine offspring international school virtual classroom on mathematics today i miss gifts ugoji brings to you multiplication of length for grade 3 class but before we proceed get your exercise book your pen or pencil then be in a quiet place so you can concentrate in this class our star words for this week are length product total meter all together I have a quiz for you are you ready three grade three boys of the same height measure 134 centimeters each what is your total height now pause this video and attempt this question then when you're done you can play it back okay now three boys from grade 3 class have the same height right since they have exactly the same height so we can simply multiply by 3 to get their total height so we'll say one boy equals 134 centimeters therefore three boys will measure three times 134 centimeters or just add 134 centimeters in three places so when you do that you get 402 centimeters hope that was what you got if you got that right it clap for you okay now multiplication is repeated addition you remember that okay to multiply length, remember your, your linear measure table, which are 10 millimeters make 1 centimeter, 100 centimeters make 1 meter, 1000 millimeters make 1 meter, and 1000 meters make 1 kilometer. Let's take an example. Eva arranged five tables each measuring 2 meters 15 centimeters long what is the total length of the tables now what are we supposed to do since we have five tables we're looking for the total length of the five tables so we write our unit first write out 2 meters 2 under meters and 15 under centimeters then we multiply by 5 now we take them one after the other. 5 times 5 gives us what? 25. So we write 5 and carry 2. Now 5 times 1, what does that give us? 5, then plus 2. 5 plus 2 is 7. Very good. Now 5 times 2, what does it give us? 5 times 2 is... 10 very good bravo now let's move to the next example the distance around the fenced estate is 5 kilometers 745 meters a man cycled it three times how far did he go now what are we supposed to do since the man cycled this fence three times so let's write our units first kilometers and meters write 500 kilometers then 745 under meters then we multiply by three now three times five three times five is 15 we write five and carry one three times four what will that give us? 3 times 4, 12. Then plus 1, 13. So we write 3 and carry 1. 
Now, 3 times 7. 3 times 7 is 21. Then plus this one you carried is what? 22. So we write down our 2 and carry 2. Now, 3 times 5. That gives 15, right? So 15 plus 2. That's 17. Now, how far did the man go? He went 17.235 kilometers or 17 kilometers, 235 meters. Wow. Now, let's do the last example. Let's multiply 8.9 meters by 2. Don't forget to write your units. Then 8.9 times 2. Okay. Now 2 times 9. 2 times 9 is what? 18. So we write 8 and carry 1. Now 2 times 8. What does that give us? 16. Then plus 1. 17. Don't forget we have a decimal point here. So what do we do? Since we have a decimal point here, how many digits do you have after the decimal point? We have only one digit after the decimal point. So we come here and count only one digit from the back. Let's go. One. They will place our point right here. So our final answer is what? 17.8 meters or 17 meters 80 centimeters. Hope you enjoyed this teaching. I have a quick evaluation for you. Pause this video and try this out. Okay? Alright, let's take a summary of what we did today. Today we simply learned multiplication of length. Take care. Bye.